This leadership development workshop targets principles set out by Commander Toropo in 2014. Despite the different areas of operation, those assuming positions of unit commanders are expected to possess high leadership qualities. They include commanding officers from the two naval bases, air transport wing, the engineering battalion, and the two infantry battalions. Started at the uh, uh, very senior level, but the objective is to you know, uh, walk down from senior level, but also walk bottom up from uh, junior NCOs and other ranks level, so that you know, every levels of command uh, go through the leadership framework so that you know, uh, when they are deployed or when they are uh, conducting any uh, operational activities, everyone takes a responsibility and, responsibility and makes a decision. This workshop aims to improve and develop stronger leaderships at all levels of command within the PNGDF. The first leadership workshop was held in 2015. This has paved the way for discussions on establishing a leadership institution within the PNGDF. We may have aircrafts, we may have ships, but no, we have people to drive that. And uh, no, when they are motivated because they have properly uh, developed the leadership at all levels, then we can achieve uh, results. So uh, that is the reason behind the establishment. And so in 20. Uh, 15, when we ran the uh, first uh, uh, workshop, uh, all the senior defense organization uh, uh, established what we called uh, uh, the foundation document, which is the uh, Laloki Accord. Now that a framework is in place, the PNGDF commander says the challenge is on the implementation aspect of it. Commander Toropo says the force is working on developing young leaders. He says this may take years, but it is a step closer to establishing a well-disciplined military. Strong leadership in the defense force, and uh, that's where we're starting, and this is our first course, and I'm proud that it's uh, kicking off uh, very successfully up here. The workshop is being conducted with assistance from the New Zealand Defence Force, Tekla Gunga, National MTV News.